Kubor Nagashlem Jong Dong San Hima. Ka jingweng yiki officer ki bala shong thai. Na ka mai halia lo ka yukta. Ka la kala long ka mat ka bakhluit. Ha ki sngi ki bala lej. Ha ka bala kenno ru ma ka jingweng yiki ta ki officer ka long ban yada yiki breu. Ki bala sha kenno bam sap. Ha ka bala dei bat ka jing pentri yiki project Jong Gagaro Hills Autonomous District Council Kamtam. Na marba don uwey u MLA. Ubadai ubah ying jong u menteri rangba ke jela. Pan yok jing syai bat sengot huk kambha. La kata ke jing weng yiki officer. Ki bala syong tad. Ka ketak ni em yiki jing tok kit. Ha ke bayi day bat ke jing mudi ke bala pak. Syaka loka yuk ta. Uwey ni kinong ya saat an ni muktiar jong kinong mudi. Ya ke mukot duma syaka loka yuk ta. Upilan ti sang ma. Ula batai syaki lat patai kubor ki bala yok banyakren bat u. Upilan, ubalong unong yang saat an, naga benta kita kepala ujar, haka bayi day bat ke jingkeno bamsap, haka rukam pentri ke projek jong ke GHADC, ula ong, bayi ya ke jing ujar halu ka yukta, persya ya wew MLA, ya wala tip kerteng usan je e sangma, bat ki wepat kepala syak keno lang, la dep ban tok kit daka loka yukta, bat la dep ruban pa, Ya ke chart sheet syaka yeng kasari ha ke ba ke ni ke mukot rumah menta ke ladon yeng bisyar jong unong bisyar hatura. Upilan ula ong baki don arti lagi jing ujar ke baka luka yukta ke ladep ban chart sheet bat ke ladon menta ha yeng kasari ne ke benta ban tian bisyar bat hap ap ban yad bat ban dep ke jing bisyar haswa baka yeng kasari hatura kan ayya ke rai. Kuman syupin kinmal, usan ji e sang ma u badai u MLA ka Mahendra Ganj Constituency u la sya u jor lembat ki wepat ki breu halor ka jing kenok bamsap haba pentri ki projek jong ka GHADC haka por bo usan ji u klempat sya jit ban long kumu MLA. The law is very clear, as I said. Because there are so many debates, so many discussions, so many statements, views, by different person, different political parties, individuals, and even the, the victims. In this regard, I should say that any person who is agreed, because I as I, I as as I said earlier, that Lokaita chairman, chairman person of the Lokaita has removed those officers. They there is there is no bar for the victims. That means those three officers who were removed. They can if they really will. I mean, they, they want to. Continue or uh, whatever they can approach the court. It is the court to interpret because I we should respect because you and I and anybody can say our own views. I can say he is right. You may say wrong. Then who will, who will interpret the law? After all, we cannot say I cannot say oh statement given by so and so and this politician or that individual is wrong. I I cannot say. Because they have every right to say whatever they know, and then because we have our own views and our own understanding, so we will say. But ultimately, who will decide? My views and your views. It is the court to decide. Once the court is decided, we have to accept it. Now, somebody said something. They said that it may be right. They maybe said that removal is illegal. Maybe right or wrong. It is their personal opinion. So we cannot say there whatever statement is wrong. We cannot say that also. We cannot say right it also. In the media, I think it's just everybody can give their opinion. There is nothing wrong, I and mean, there is no bar. I also can say something. You also can say what your own views. But uh, but what I should say is that if those officers, if they feel that they are agreed by the order of the removal. There is no bar for them to go into the high court and uh, or any court to challenge the order. So court will pass an order, or court will see to that, and then court will interpret. Because it is said that any litigants, suppose we are everybody is not an expert, law expert. You may write, I may write, or may, your 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 view may be right, my view may be right. Suppose both of us are saying that you are right, I am wrong. In that case, what happened? Litigants go to the court and they find a case. The court will interpret. Why? Because 
in the court we will know the truth we are going to the court to know the truth to know the truth what is the court pass an order we have to accept it if still agree there is no part we can still go to the higher court but ultimately since we are doubt i may say that this is right this is wrong i may say it's illegal and another person may say what i think is illegal may be uh, illegal so in that case what happened ultimately both a party will approach the court then court will decide in this in this particular case also they regarding the removal also people they have every right to give their own views huh, and comments and after you are understanding maybe they are right they may right also they may wrong also but ultimately the real person their problem to interpret is the court who will interpret what i'm trying to say is that if those three officers if they want they can if they feel that it's illegal they can they can approach the court they can approach the court there's no bar then court will say that removal is illegal removal is uh, rightful whatever court will uh, give the true body the truth he will the uh, court will pass a order then accordingly we have to accept so there is nothing uh, in that one that they can approach the court so once they approach the court court will see to it whether it's illegal or illegal there are two charge that cases which i have just now i have stated then so actually it's one uh, petition complaint petition has been filed against only four against one particular person individually now is uh, sanjay esamma uh, prior to his become emil now he has been then elected as emil in that particular case charge cheated has been filed against him and other mdc ex mdc they were that time since along with him and other 9 or 10 9 to 10 ex mdc were also in both their names also are in in the charge sheet so as i said earlier charge sheet has been filed now it is already they have submitted to the court uh, special court tura trial is going on i don't know what stage it has reached maybe now trial me they will call they will call for uh, evidence or they might have taken to the consideration of charge that all those things would go on in the court that is a thing another against the same thing only same matter only this sanjay and other 11 mdc they have filed in the high court challenging the order of the charge it order against the order of the law and that case is still pending on them. now what i should say that the law will take its own course now it is still under under uh, under trial because uh, the uh, in the high court still we need to file an appeal bit in the lower court i did, i don't know what exact uh, stage they have reached it. but it is still pending in the court of uh, special court tura or any sort of order there is a scope that there, there is a remedy that's a thing haba kli la ka jingweng no ka loka yukta ye ki laingot ki officer ki bala song thai kan kta ni em hak bai dei bar ka jing to kit ye ki jing u jor ki bala pha she ka loka yukta u pilan u long ba ka jingweng bat thung bujli de ki wei pat ki officer kanam kta namar ki officer ki ban sawan thmai ru ki ha ban yat kat kum ka ai ban pendap ya ka kamram ka bala bin shen haki kumta une unong sai an jong ki ba mudui ulong magajing wang ki officer ki bala song thai na ka loka yukta kam kta ya ka jing u jor jong ki bat kam kta aru ya ka jing to kit namar ka loka yukta kala de ban chat sheet na du shwa ban wang ya ki officer ki bala song thai menta ki jing mudui kila don ha yeng kasari hatura ban bishar hadin ba ka loka yukta kala de ban chat chi ula ongru bahabai dei bat ka jing u jor ya usanji e sangma bat ki wei pan ka jing to kit de ka loka yukta kala de la kham slam ha upnai ha usnem bala de bat ka loka yukta kala de ru ban chat chi ka basa ka dei satang ka jing tian bishar de ka yeng kasari jong nong bishar hatura bat an am ya ka yeng kasari ban rai bat le khat kum ka ai upilan udei wei ni ki nong sat ai u baju ya khon ni ki kam bam sam 
Madulong ru unong satan, jom kinong ujor na rilom garo, hakibabun teli kimukot duma. In my view, changing of the officers of Lokaita, it, it will not it will not affect, uh, uh, particularly those cases which have been charged it and those cases which have been pending in the High Court and which is pending uh, in the Court of Special Judge. Because those must have already been charged it has been already fight, the trial go, going on, and the investigation officer as of now, they have nothing to do because they have already submitted. Now they will take the evidence. Uh, in my view, uh, the law is very clear. Now, once the matter has been in the court, nobody can interfere. Nobody can interfere. And uh, that changing of the officer of local uh, will not affect the case which is pending in the High Court and also which is in the, pending in the special judge. It, the, once any people or any person or any individual file a complaint case before the particular forum, we have to, we must have the faith because we faith in the judiciary, we faith in the, in the forum or the commission. So suppose if any person agree by the order of the investigation officer, any person is agreed by the uh, order of the logaita or any court, there are remedy they can go, they can go, nobody can stop. So. Now people may think it, uh, that due to the changing of the officer of Lokaita, uh, they have, they may believe or they may think up or feeling that this investigation or pending case will affect. It will not affect. It will, it will not affect uh, particularly those cases which already been in, in that court. It is in the court. Even even it, which is still pending in the Lokaita, if any person is aggrieved by the investigation officer or any order passed by the Lokaita. It is not end there. They can still approach to the proper forum or to the higher court. Say, for example, if a person who filed a complaint before the Lokaita and he don't get the relief, that means he is not satisfied with the order of the Lokaita, or he might have dismissed or uh, dismissed the petition or the complaint petition. Still, there is remedy. He can go and challenge before the high court against the order of the Lokaita. Huh? That is a thing. That is a law. So. Uh, affecting or removing just because somebody officers remove it will hamper no it, it, hampering or uh, may not hamper that I will not say but any person who is agreed by the investigation officer or by the order of the local there's a remedy they can go to the higher court so there's nothing to be worried because yes. no <clears throat> in my view I have already stated once the matter is in the court, once the matter is in the court, maybe the matter may be uh, related to any chief minister or any politician. Once the matter is in the court, nobody can interfere. It will not affect because law will take its own course. The court, we court, the judiciary will take their own. Uh, they will take. They will play their own role. So, once the matter is rich to the court. This, uh, I be it uh, the relative of minister or anybody, we should not have any fear because law will take its own course. The court will pass an order seeing the, uh, take, after taking the uh, relevant witnesses and other order procedure, after completing order procedure, they will pass appropriate order. If still any person, the party is still agreed, by the order of uh, the maybe special judge or any higher court, still they can challenge that in the higher forum or in the higher court. That's the only thing. So there is once what I am trying to say is once matter reach to the court, so it will not affect. It will not affect. It's not going to affect by uh, just because the active person or the person involved is close relative. They have this they have nothing to do. Moreover this is separate judiciary we have to we must have a trust and belief in the judicial system. That's why Hello Kito ki officer Kibala Shong Tai Kibala Sha Weng Nakakam Hakaluka Yukta Upilan Ulaong Balada Kito ki officer ki snow bakila sha you right yaka hok junkie kila ban let shaka yang bishar but pun snow yaka jing e junkie.
Bat ka ying bisharu kan saong, la kata ka de ka babian ni en. Bat hangtaan sa shay, bat hapan pedyang ya ka e ka baka ying bishar ka airai. Kaluka yukta dang shen ka laweng ya ki laingut ki ofisa ki bala syong tait na ka kam. Bat ka jaka jong ki la thung bujli di ki ofisa ki badang don ha ka kam. Bat ki badai ha ka kerdan sekretari syaneng. There are many cases people have come up and they file a case against the uh, corruption, like against some individuals as well as against some contractors for non-completion of the project. And then I should say shortly there are many cases uh, people have filed different complaints, they have come up and then they have filed a complaint petition before the court of law five times since from 2019. And then there are two cases which uh, recently had been charged it. Uh, by the court of Lokaita. After going to the procedure, I mean like the Lokaita after filing of the case, Lokaita would pass an order for preliminary inquiry. Thereafter, uh, preliminary inquiry, then they will be given an opportunity, both the party, to file their so course or to file a reply. And on the basis of, after hearing both the parties, again, court will pass an order, Lokaita court will pass an order, uh, for detailed investigation. If there is a prima facie case or something is material on record, court will pass the necessary order to for investigation. After the filing of the investigation, that concern IO or investigation official, they will submit and they have submitted also. After the submission of the investigation, detailed investigation, the locator will again the court of locator will see to the detailed investigation. And then, if found materials, prima facie is there, then he will file a charge it. Now, in this particular two case, so far, Lokaita filed only two charges, eh? as I remember. There are many cases still pending and still under investigation. But so far, two cases have been charged, eh? and it is still uh, charged, eh? the trial is going on before the uh, special judge court, Tura. Now, in my view, I should say, law is very clear, once the case has been charged and it has been submitted to the competent court, nobody can interfere. There is nothing to worry uh, with regards to what will happen. In that that law will take its own course. So, if any person who is agreed by the order of the special court or trial, that they will take uh, the legal recourse in their future. They can take the plea on uh, if any party is agreed. So, as a matter that law will take its own course, there is nothing to be worried because uh, charge it means now, even in the there two cases which uh, Lokaita file charge it uh, against uh, Mr. Uh, there is one present Emily also, Sanjay A. Samma, against him, and the trial is also going on. Another case is uh, in the case of uh, Ismail and uh, where trial also is still going on. Then, and another case, uh, uh, in the same case, in the case of Sanjay, there were other, beside him, there are other uh, nine or 10 XMDC. They were also, their name was also appeared in the charge. And they were still, they were challenging the order of the charge that order against the order of the Lokaita. Now case is still pending for hearing and uh, one, uh, we have, uh, file the affidavit uh, in reply, affidavit in opposition, another still yet to file and then it will go on. But then the trial, the court has not stayed the uh, proceeding, which means that these two cases have been charged it, and the trial is sti still going on in the, uh, the court of special court of uh, Tura, it will take its own course. Okay. However, the high court has not stayed the proceeding, that means trial will carry on. But uh, against at the same time that repetition is pending in the same uh, against the same subject matter but uh, since the court has not stayed the uh, proceeding so time will go on and uh, uh, simultaneously in the high court we have we, we have filed one opinion in opposition and then the final hearing is still pending another one is